Hi everyone, John here from All Miniatures Great and Small, and today we're going to be doing a Warhammer 40k unboxing and look at the Space Marine Primaris Invader ATV. Now this is one of the new releases for um, when Codex, the new Codex for Space Marines came out. So they had their first wave for 9th edition with the starter box. Um, you had some cool new Space Marine units. And then um, with the Codex coming out this month and the, uh, the cool new releases that came along with it have hit the shelves. So the Primaris uh, Invader ATV is basically a Space Marine Mario Kart. Um, I think it looks pretty cool. Let's look at the back side. <clears throat> so you see it's got a little bit of the, uh, the tumbler from Batman movies. A little bit of Mario Kart going on. This poor guy's riding pretty low, but looks cool. Um, looks like you get two options in the kit. You get a um, cannon and a multi melt I guess that is. Yeah. Uh, so, pretty cool. All right, let's cr crack this open and take a look at the kit. Now, you may or may not know, I collect Ultramarines. Um, something like this, I imagine the Raven Guard, or maybe the Dark Angels Raven Wing. There we go, would like it. All right, so we get two sprues in the box, instructions, and some decals. Let's take a look at these sprues. We'll look at that one for next. So it looks like the driver is halfway molded into the model. The gunner's feet are there. Looks pretty cool. I like the Primaris uh, aesthetic. Oh, there's the uh, gun for the gunner. I guess that's an onslaught cannon. It's probably not a heavy onslaught cannon, but just a regular onslaught cannon. The multi melta And then I think it has a couple of auto bolt rifles, if I remember correctly. All right, so that's that sprue. Nice, good, solid plastic. Then here we've got... Um, <clears throat> the wheels and the crew it looks like so you've got that gunner primaris nothing special on the tire treads but Pretty cool. All right, so there you go. That's the plastic that comes in the kit. Instruction-wise, well, that means no glue required. Is this entire model push fit? Interesting. <clears throat> so there are the uh, two options. I'm hoping that piece can just be swapped out so I don't have to build it one way or another. Pretty straightforward. There's how about. So it'll be interesting to see if that can be swapped out. I wonder if those pieces can just bend and you can pop that in there. Because it looks like they use entirely separate pieces. It's a different gun shield. 
they both have the same mounting point. <clears throat> Excuse me, so it's just getting those hands onto the gun, but the way that they're situated I, situated, I bet you could just pop that gun right in there. Not even have to fuss with some magnetization. And then they do the uh, stats with these icons uh, in these kits nowadays, but the um, the rule book has a, a more um, <clears throat> a more accurate stat card that's easier to read. So let's uh, take a look at that next. All right, here's the uh, new Space Marine Codex, the Invader ATV. You can take uh, up to three of these guys in one squad, which is pretty cool. Um, it has a movement of 14, so it's pretty fast, uh, twice, more than twice as fast as a guy on foot. Weapon skill, ballistic skill 3+, plus, strength of 4, toughness 5, so it's um, as tough as Gravis armor, but no tougher. Uh, eight wounds, so it's the equivalent of four Primaris Marines. Four attacks, leadership 7, 3 plus save. Then weapons wise, um, it has uh, uh, equipped with a bolt pistol, onslaught Gatling cannon, and twin auto bolt rifles and frag and crack grenades. And then any number of models can have their onslaught Gatling cannon replaced with one multi melta. So you've got uh, so the, basically you've got pistol, um, onslaught Gatling cannon, which has the the new stats, it's 24 inch range, uh, heavy 8, strength 5, minus 1 AP, 1 damage. Your twin auto bolt rifles, those are the ones that get you more shots, so it's assault 6. Uh, only 24 inch range, no minus on the AP, so pretty much just standard bolt, bolter gun stats there. But if you can, uh, let's see, yeah, assault 6, that's really nice. And then, uh, You've got the multi melto, which has the new multi melta stats. Uh, the 24 inch heavy 2, strength 8, minus 4, d6 damage. But if you attack within half range, the damage characteristic is d6 plus 2. Now that's changed uh, from, you know, roll two dice and pick the highest. So your maximum capped damage is theoretically higher. You could roll a 6 and you're doing 8 damage uh, per hit, which is pretty pretty scary so um, as far as abilities this thing has uh, angels of death a turbo boost which just means if you do advance you just get an automatic six instead of having to roll a die uh, or if it's raven wing it gets the raven wing keyword and if it explodes it does one mortal wound to units within three inches of it the keywords are imperium adeptus astartes chapter Biker, Primaris, and Invader ATB Squad. Now, what's interesting is, I know people have been talking about this quite a bit, is the fact that this unit currently synergizes with the Space Marine Apothecary. Uh, meaning that if you have a squad of three of these and one of them dies, the Apothecary could bring that Invader ATV back to life. Um, and... I don't know if that's intended or not, but that's a very powerful, you're bringing back a unit that costs, uh, you know, quite a few points versus, um, you know, just bringing back an infantry guy that died. So let's take a look at the um, Invader ATV's points. I don't know if you can see that, Invader ATV is 80 points per model, and the multi melta upgrade is 5 points. So... 85 points multi melta going after vehicles or 80 points with the onslaught cannon um, which is good against you know well, everything except high toughness of vehicles so um yep there you go that's kind of a look at the primaris invader atv the box itself runs uh 40 dollars us um there are some online retailers where you can find it a little bit cheaper but um, I think it looks pretty cool. I'm looking forward to adding it to my army. I don't know if I'll get more than one. Maybe maybe two so I could run a squad of two. I don't know if um, I'd ever want three. Maybe, but 
we'll see. That's a lot of wounds if you have three of these guys. That is, uh, you know, 24 wounds. So that's more wounds than a um, Primaris, you know, a full Primaris squad of 20 guys. Um, but I just think it looks cool. It looks like a little miniature remote control tumbler from Batman. Pretty cool. All right, guys. Well, there you go. I'm sure I'm going to have a, a video talking about the new Space Marine Codex. And, um, you know, since I'm an Ultramarine player, focusing there, but giving you guys my thoughts on the book as a whole for any uh, Space Marine player. But uh, in the meantime, I'm going to be increasing the ranks of the Ultramarines. As always, we appreciate you watching here on YouTube. Please do give us a like and subscribe. Click that bell to receive notification when we publish new content. Uh, also, you can check us out on Facebook at All Miniatures Great and Small. Please let me know down in the comments below, too. I'd love to hear your feedback. Have you used these guys? What do you think? Um, are you concerned about the apothecary synergy with these guys? Me, I'm not too sure how that works. One of the advantages, it seems like, of this thing is it moves 14 inches, whereas an apothecary is on foot. I don't think they have a bike version of an apothecary yet. Boy, but if they did, that, that could really be bad. And I expect that to... Um, I expect that to be FAQ'd into oblivion, that, that rule, but who knows. Games work, the, trying to decipher the mind of Games Workshop it can be futile at times. So there you go, guys. I'm, I'm happy with my purchase. I'll probably have a what's on the table uh, in the next week or two uh, showing you my progress on this guy. But I do want to get it on the table uh, sooner rather than later so that I can uh, crush the Xenos and traitor forces that oppose me. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and keep on wargaming.